Ooh. Hello, I'm Sam Riley. Fuck it. <laughs> <laughs> Hello, I'm Sam Riley. Uh, I play Dierval in Maleficent, and uh, here's a clip. Du bist aber neugierig. Bring sie zu mir. Ich weiß, dass du da bist. Hab keine Angst. Ich habe keine Angst. Dann komm raus. Dann wirst du Angst haben. Okay, now I'm going to show you some of my favorite films. Follow me. Mm. One of my all-time favorites is Chinatown by Roman Polanski, Jack Nicholson and Faye Dunaway. It's, for me, the 70s American cinema is one of the best eras of uh, Hollywood where directors had a lot more control than the producers, unlike today. But of course, some of them took it too far and then now it's all producers again. But this is a great, yeah, not neo-noir, but a classic noir film. And Jack Nicholson also from, had some of the best roles in the 70s. I'm always jealous watching him. Another class movie, and everybody says it, is Taxi Driver. But if you've not seen it for a while, what's amazing is just how raw and um, real the scenes look when they're shooting in New York and everything. And it's a sort of iconic picture, but it's really a strange, horrible, dark movie about a horrible, sick guy. I mean, and it's a genius performance from De Niro and also Jodie Foster. It's scary how good she is. Oh man, so many good films though. Robin Hood, Errol Flynn. I also like the Kevin Costner version, which is not very cool, but I was 13 when it came out, so what can you do? This is another great film. I, mean, my, I get a lot of my influences from my father, who's a huge movie fan, and he used to tell me and my brother what films were cool when they were on TV from the 70s. He was a big Gene Hackman fan. And again, this is just gritty and and real you know when they're in the cold you see the air coming out of their mouths it's it's not exactly a classic storyline either it's it's a god film this is also a brilliant film warren beatty bonnie and clyde also a similar similar era you're getting a good idea of my favorite decade anyway where are we now moving along the dritter man <gasps> What a cool DVD shop. Awesome. One of the best film noirs. It's a cliche, but if you haven't seen it for a long time, it is a brilliant film. Auch. Well now, the film I'm promoting here is a Disney film. And I think of all the Disney films, The Jungle Book. Jungle. Is my favorite. The best songs. And a lot of the other ones are a bit girly. Whereas this one is cool for boys, uh, especially this one. I think, uh, I think everyone's familiar with that, but that's probably my favorite Disney movie. <laughs> Everybody does. There we go. Oh, look, special edition. Guy film, Mrs. Riley playing Mickey Lauder's wife. Top performance from Daniel Brühl. Watch it in English, not German synchronization, please. God, this is such a cool store, man. I'm definitely coming back. Okay, I'm a big James Bond fan. I have to admit it. For me, he is James Bond and will always be James Bond, even when he's wearing a peruca. And Goldfinger is probably my favorite because in the opening credit sequence, that they always do before the titles. This was kind of the first one where they really did it. And when he unzips the, what do they call it? The wetsuit and he's got a tuxedo underneath and a duck on his head. Classic. And Sean, you can't beat Sean. Now, 
also. Another favorite of mine as a young man, young boy, is Lawrence of Arabia. It's Peter O'Toole's first film, really, first lead role. I think it took him about two years to make it. Um, and some people say he never really did manage to do anything quite as good as this ever again. I think that's bollocks, but I, I dressed like, a, like Lawrence of Arabia for about six weeks after watching this, much to my parents' worry and horror but uh, there you go. It's a classic film. It's very long. Ah! Also, I love a good Western. This trilogy from Sergio Leone. Zwei, what, is that the second one? Yeah. Ah, oh, man, they've got all my favorites. Doctor Strange Love. Probably my favorite Kubrick movie. This is genius. And Peter Sellers is one of my favorite comic actors. I also love him in the Pink Panther movies playing several roles. And it's, it's probably the best anti-war movie um, and heading towards World War III as we are right now. This is probably one that Putin and Obama could get into. Oh, yeah, that's what a, what a brilliant movie. <laughs> Buy it. Genius. <laughs> um, now, oh, I used to play in a band before becoming a musician. And it's embarrassing, it's difficult to watch as a musician because they are so correct with how embarrassing it is being a musician and how self-centered we all are as well. Man, das ist auch ein geiles Film. Top soundtrack, Raw, Jimmy Cliff. This is, this is a geil film, what a cool story, honestly. Well, that was a few of my favorite movies. Uh, if you haven't seen them, check them out. Uh, Maleficent will be out in Kinos, 29 to May. Be there or be square. If you want to know more about the movie, visit, mo visit moviepilot.de. Cheers, I've got a taxi. <laughs>